What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today we have another episode of My Damn Hauls. Episode number 15 to be exact. We have six packages right here. I only honestly know what is in two of them. I cannot remember the rest of them. And so it's going to be a surprise. It's going to be a surprise on four of the packages. We do have a package from Wrestling Hero Figs. Yes, my boy Wrestling Hero Figs. We got a package from him. We got a package from Toys R Us that I swear to God it took an eternity. I literally ordered that figure like forever ago and it's just now getting here so that's whatever but you know at least it's here finally but let's go ahead and get straight into these packages and find out what the rest of them are so the first package we have up right here is from ebay and now that i am feeling the package i feel like i do remember what is in here um it is two figures one of which is a mattel and a me tail one of which is a mattel and one of which is a jack so sliding the two figures out right here they are packaged really, really well, so that's good, always nice to have. And um, let's go ahead and get these things unraveled. So right here we have the two figures that we got, and the first one is this Jax Kurt Angle, and it does have the cloth singlet on there. And the reason I picked this up is because um, I feel like I could use the head scan for a custom. I've used this before on a Kurt Angle Custom Elite. And um, I don't know, I wanted to try out the singlet, see what it looked like on a Mattel, just to, you know, play around, maybe cut off right here and have the singlet, like, you know, the uh, straps down or whatever. And then we have the Sick AF Straight Edge Society CM Punk Basic. Um, these were from the same seller. I got both of these for like $10 shipped um, with free shipping, so that's really, really awesome. Uh, I love this head scan a lot. I love this punk head scan. We've got the elbow pad right there. And I wish this thing was an elite because, my God, I love the kick pads. So it has uh, SES right there on the side. And I really wish that we would have gotten that Degum G.I. Joe CM Punk Elite. That would have been amazing. Even in basic form, that would have been amazing. This is almost there, but not quite it. But let's go ahead and get straight into the next package. All right, guys, next up is another package from eBay. And I think this is a... Uh, a part to a custom that I had uh, a guy commissioned from me. I'm not completely sure, but I'm about 80% sure that's what this is. And yes, this is a part for one of the guy's customs, and it is a Jax Titan Tron Live Hardcore Holly figure. So we get it out right here. As you can see, this figure is a piece of trash. If you, um, this figure is really a piece of trash, to be honest with you. I only got it for the head scan, but yeah, as you guys see, if you guys are young, you do realize that you guys are so blessed with great figures. Like, this is what we had to deal with as kids. Like, look at this trash. That is awful, but this head scan will be good for our hardcore Holly. I'll probably have to repaint it up, but I am looking forward to making that custom, and I am excited to get started on it. So let's move on to the next package. Up next, we have yet again another eBay package. And this could be a custom part, but I'm not completely sure. And it is this WrestleMania. It is this WrestleMania Stone Cold Steve Austin figure, as you see right here in the blue jeans. Um, I had a guy, the same guy that commissioned the Hardcore Holly, requested a Sandman. So what I'm going to be doing is using this torso and pants... Uh, painting the tattoo on the arm, replacing the head scan with a Sandman, and then just throwing a custom shirt on there. Very simple way to do a Sandman. Um, it's pretty much going to be exactly like the Sandman that you see in the uh, MDT wrestling, so be uh, stay tuned for that. But yes, that is all for this package, and we're moving on to the next one. Alright guys, for this next one, we have a big one, and I'm going to be real with you. I have no idea what is in this. Uh, we got a sealed air package right here, but I'm just going to cut it straight down the middle right there. Hopefully... That didn't damage anything, but cutting this open, and there's still a plastic baggie, Jesus. So we cut open that envelope to find it in another box, so now we will cut open the box. Okay, guys, so I opened up the box, and we have another envelope. And I, like, good God, man. You're going to wrap this thing up, like, 850 times? I don't even know where this is from, to be real with you. But, um, I think this is a Mock Elite. I don't even, hold up. 
Well, that was a complete waste for nothing, guys. We opened all these packages to find a freaking Adam Rose Elite, and the reasoning for this is more custom parts. Uh, I'm going to use it to make uh, Young Bucks, so this will be the base for one of the Young Bucks. I have another Adam Rose that I will show you guys in just a few minutes, but yeah, all that work for just an Adam Rose. So we're moving on to Wrestling Hero Fix package. Alright guys, up next we have a package from the man himself, Wrestling Hero Figs. And opening it right up, you see that we have the freaking TNF Seth Rollins. So freaking excited to have this. Uh, me and Hero Figs did a trade, and we have a note from the man right here. And he says... Hey, it's Wrestling Hero Figs. I hope you enjoy Seth Rollins. If you don't, you know what's going to happen. Bam! Steel chair shot. So that is awesome. Thank you guys, or thank you so much, Wrestling Hero Figs. We have this amazing Seth Rollins figure um, that I've been looking for forever. Me and him did a trade. I traded him one of the Goldbergs that you saw in the last episode um, of My Damn Halls with the four free elites or whatever. But um, yeah, I traded him one of those to finally get my hands on this TNF Seth Rollins that I'm just so glad to have now. Um, I think I have every single Seth Rollins now, and I have a ton of them. I have like 11 or 12 elite Seth Rollins that Mattel has released, so I'm very excited to have that. And we have another WWE Championship to go with it. So thank you so much to Wrestling Hero Figs, but now we are moving on to the last package on this episode of My Damn Halls. Actually, guys, before we get into that last package, I want to show you guys a few figures that I picked up from the flea market the other day, my good buddy James Taylor uh, hooked me up with some great deals on these Elite figures. So what I got right here is this Elite 38 Adam Rose. Again, that was for uh, custom parts for Young Bucks. Um, we picked up this Drew McIntyre Basic. Um, again, the head scan is to save the customer uh, some money, so we picked up that uh, Drew McIntyre Basic so that we can uh, you know, use the head scan. I picked up this Rey Mysterio which is absolutely incredible. So happy to expand the uh, Rey Mysterio collection. Up next we have this Elite 36 Dean Ambrose. Always good to have Dean Ambrose. Up next we have this Elite 42 Triple H. Very excited to expand the Triple H collection. Up next we have this Elite 39 Dolph Ziggler. You know, you know I gotta expand my Dolph Ziggler collection. Always happy to pick up another Dolph Ziggler. And then the last thing we picked up was this Elite 24 Dolph Ziggler. So two Dolph Zigglers, a Triple H, a Dean Ambrose, Adam Rose, Drew McIntyre, and Rey Mysterio. Very excited. And then the last thing that we picked up was an X-Pac Elite. And I know I told you guys that I'm working on a Hurricane Elite uh, custom, and this is what I have so far. So we have the head scan on an X-Pac body, the sleeves and everything. I think it'll look really good once I get it painted up nicely, remove this DX stuff. Um, it'll definitely work, and you will be seeing Hurricane in the pick fed, so stay tuned for that. But very excited with the way this came out. Even have the tattoo right there that I painted on. Um, very excited to have that, but now we can move on to the final package on this episode. Alright guys, this last package comes from Toys R Us, and I'm going to be real with you. I don't think I'll ever order from Toys R Us ever again. Like, I'm so serious. Um, this is the first time I've ever ordered directly from their site, and it'll probably be the last, because I literally ordered this thing, like probably two and a half weeks ago and that's just unacceptable uh i get spoiled you know from walkout wear and amazon and even ebay honestly you know they ship so quick but um removing all this trash from the box underneath all of it you will finally see the long-awaited network spotlight aj styles figure let's go ahead and crack this thing out of the package because i want to get a closer look at it all right guys here we have aj styles and first glance at the figure, I am very happy with the way they did it. You know, I made that post on Instagram about his glove decal being upside down. You know, the AJ is supposed to be flipped the other way. And everybody got the wrong idea. thought I was talking about his crotch, which I didn't even think about it. I just saw the image. I saw the image that somebody posted of the figure, and it had the gloves. And I was like, dang, I just noticed that it's not even accurate. So then I went to Google, immediately just found a picture of AJ threw the layout together and then posted it. I didn't even notice his, uh, you know, his crotch area, but this figure is dope. I do love the color scheme. That WrestleMania 33 attire where he fought Shaming Man looks amazing. Um, the only thing that I will be doing with this figure, though, is I will be doing a torso swap. So I will be doing a torso swap 
with this right here it'll be with this triple h figure and um, I'll paint up the, uh, I'll put the chest hair on there, you know, put the decal on there so it will be accurate. It won't just be a blank torso. So, yeah, that will be the first thing that I will be doing with this figure. But I so am happy that it finally arrived from Toys R Us with their terrible shipping. But now I will line up all the figures that we got and finish up this episode. Alright guys, here we have the entire haul all lined up, and I gotta say, what a very successful haul. I mean, we got Network Spotlight AJ Styles, we got TNF Seth Rollins from my boy Wrestling Hero Figs, we got Custom Elite Hurricane that I threw together, we got freaking two more Dolph Zigglers, I mean, the list goes on, great pieces in here. Great Rey Mysterio Elite, just a lot of custom parts, and we are just killing it in this haul today. Leave a like, leave a comment on down below on what you think about this haul, guys. That is going to do it for this video. Subscribe for more epic WWE and WWE figure-related videos, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much.